So what's up guys, how are you doing today? Alright, I want to just make a video <laughs> even though no one no one will watch this but yeah, maybe I'll still remind myself to remind myself not to buy a house like out of town anymore you see, you see because I live I now I bought a house which is cheaper out of town but the problem is the commute, you know uh, even though if you will have your own transportation the gas and the time Especially if uh, that I'm commuting, like right now, it, it's hard. Commuting is hard, so I'll, I'll, I want to go to the electric company, but it's gonna take me like an hour to wait for a bus. So right here, so yeah, you you either suffer from a heat stroke outside. Waiting for a bus or die from boredom, I guess. So it's a huge lesson. I lost a lot of money, but at least you know uh, you can get it back. But the good thing is I've already sold it, and hopefully I could go uh, leave this place by next week and go to my new place, new house. That's closer than this. And the commute is much easier, and even the transportation. Even though uh, we have a car, it will be easier to my new home. So this is a huge uh, mistake, but you know we gotta keep on living, living, and learn from our mistakes. Uh, money we can still get, uh, earn more money. You know we can't get back the money here, but. We have to move on, uh, cut our losses short, and uh, hopefully make better decisions in the future. So, you know, it's cheap, but it's not that cheap. Uh, the only reason I think I got a house here because uh, they accept like uh, uh, self-employed that that don't that don't have like. Uh, income tax returns uh, uh, self-employed that don't have like a business of their own you know I'm just maybe freelance you can call it freelance I have income but I have no like documents uh, they want like maybe income tax return from your business but I don't have a business so uh, self-employed is like a term difficult uh, to uh, determine what form of legally uh, what form of like uh, is your occupation as a YouTuber? So maybe like a freelance. So freelance, yeah, you just come and go. So banks don't like banks don't like it. You just can you can just come and go. So uh, even the companies like this, but at least you know companies like this accept uh, freelance as long as they can see that you have like a source of income, a uh, stable source of income. Uh, well, what I can show them is like my. The income that, it's, that that Google sends me, uh, the documents, whatever, uh, proof of income. But I don't have any uh, like employment certificate or something or proof of employment. But you know they're less strict. But it's so far here, uh, and if you have an emergency. It's it's terrible. If you have a health emergency here, it's terrible. Living far away, especially I live alone. You know your neighbors could help you, but. At, to what extent, you know, not uh, not all the time, especially like uh, I had a toothache like in the middle of the night, you know. Well, it's fine if it's, if it's just a toothache. What about uh, if you have a heart attack in the middle of the night, you know? So, <laughs> so it's gonna be hard, like, uh, or, or whatever sickness that's not that intense, you know. You need to go to emergency, like buy medicines or hospital, go to the hospital, like after midnight so you're gonna like bother your neighbors here yeah I don't have family here so so if I, I'm a bit closer if I'm closer to the city so uh, I can I can get help easier faster and uh, like uh, you can get things uh, things are more accessible I can buy more things stuff like that uh, especially the commute you know at least uh, to my new location, the commute is better even though at night here it's like out of town. Oh my god, cost is out of town. So, and you 
shouldn't cut off yours. I shouldn't, shouldn't have cut off myself with people in society. Maybe because it was the pandemic. And just my personality is an introvert. But this is uh, uh, this is overboard, you know. This is just uh, too much, you know. Too much, too much of an introvert will also be uh, terrible, be a bad thing. So I don't want. I need to have a balance, you know, sort. But it's hard being an introvert, you know. Yeah, so and the, and the people out of town are are like uh, less trustworthy, I guess, or more dangerous. So it's 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 less it's less safer out of town. I'm not saying that it's a lot. It's 100% safe uh, near the city, but out of town, it's it's less safer. You know, it's a lot scarier here. Um, even though I'm capable of defending myself, but you know uh, when you leave the house. Uh, it's it's uh and the walls here in the subdivision they're open walls so it's like when I leave the house you know uh, I'm not I don't have much peace of mind but well given that <laughs> even though you're in the city but it, it you know if you know what I mean you know it's it's a lot more uh, it's a less le less safer here you know the less actually the less people <laughs> the less safer. <laughs> But it's hard, you know. I just wanted to be a YouTuber and have like a quiet environment to make videos. But I don't, I don't want. But I realized I can still make it work without having like a quiet environment, you know. I don't need to have the top quality anyway. So I've proven it. I don't need to have a uh, top tier quality to succeed in YouTube. But <coughs> it would be nice though, but it having top tier quality recording studio with no background noise it's, it's so much investment it's so expensive you know but uh, uh, but we usually get I usually get criticisms as a youtuber we, we get comments uh, criticizing on our quality so. yeah so I just just have to like uh, I guess be strong and accept the things that I, I can't give that I can provide to the world you know uh, it's hard because it is, it is, it is. I don't I can't afford it so I'll just uh, keep making videos even though my audio sucks you know as long as I deliver what I want to deliver as long as the the, the viewers can understand me most of the time and as long as I'm able to help people regardless of my quality I mean that, that's fine I guess but maybe I could improve in the quality a couple of years from now but I don't, I don't think I will be staying long in that place in my uh, second house new house but yeah because, uh, I'm targeting a better location so have a great day